We are here at Jefferson Barracks at National Cemetery Park. National Guard is an active military base. They have two trails in this park for the 30 for 30. So we're gonna do this first one at the Dennis Schick Trail. It's like the main entrance where you come past the National Cemetery. And it is a paved loop. Walk it twice for two miles. And the little punch is over here on this sign right here. Bless you, honey. Wasn't it on this sign or was I thinking wrong? There it is. All right, we're number 25 on our punch card, honey. Taco Bell. <laughs> Fitness course, isn't that kind of like a... Significantly historic. 25? Yes, 25. So all throughout this park, they have this historic markers that talk about the history of each section. This was parade grounds. It's pretty cool. So if you're ever in St. Louis, I definitely recommend visiting Jefferson Barracks. It is pretty darn cool. We come here a lot. They have all kinds of activities throughout the year. They even have Easter egg hunts for adults here. But right now we're gonna do this loop. It wasn't supposed to rain, but it's looking a little cloudy over there. I checked the west, so this is August, um, and it cooled down. It's still warm, it's 80 something. Um, but yeah, I always check the weather out first thing every morning and no rain, but tell me that's not a rain cloud right there. This is the active military base. You can see it, but you can, can you also see the fence with the barbed wire and the dozens of uh, dragonflies? But anyway, <laughs> you have to get past security to go see any of those buildings. But these buildings you can see right here, these are different little museums. listening to cicadas. Oh, this guy's dead. He's covered in ants. We hear some morning doves. Can you hear that? And they have these little exercise stands throughout the park. It's like we're walking. Isn't that exercise enough? Is that the dove right there? That's a dove. I think. Looks like a dove. Kind of dovey. There's something right there too. Can I hear a train? And then we're also near the Mississippi River. They have a stripper pole here so you can practice your squatting. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just teasing. It's not a stripper pole. Kind of looks like one now. As many times as we've walked these paths, have you ever actually seen anyone use these extra challenge equipment? Those people that by us. They were using it? Mm -hmm. oh. All right. I guess I get used. I guess I'm the only. I don't know. I've 
I mean, lazy one. <laughs> Walking's enough work for me. I don't know, like, if the military guys ever come over here. Um, uh, maybe. Maybe. maybe no, no. I mean, they maintain it, so. Oh my god, look at those scary spider webs. They maintain it, so. It leads me to believe someone's actually using them. I'm just being cranky because I haven't had lunch yet. She just had breakfast. I had cake. I had a piece of your birthday cake. It was delicious. We go that way or that way? Like we're supposed to go to the right. I think we go to the right because it was a loop. It's just, yeah. What's that? I don't know. Let's see. It tells you if you get confused. Oh, Whoa. and <laughs> I go down. Oh my god! I just twisted my ankle. It tells you it's what to do. Yeah. yeah, it looks like something's That's living, fine. living right there. Oh my god! Careful not to twist your ankle. Just you just did it. They want to make sure you're really paying attention. I think I mentioned earlier in the video, but I'll say it again. So the loop is one mile and the guide recommends you walking it twice. So you get like 2.2 miles. Just keep in mind it's a loop because there's several offshoots to other trails. It's not clearly marked, so you can definitely get off path pretty quickly. And yeah, I don't believe that it's 80. Tell me what temperature it is, Robert. I'm feeling 90 right now. <laughs> what is this one? Oh, you're supposed to, it's a rope climb, but it's a pole. It's a pole. Can you climb this, Robert? No, I'm not gonna even try. It's like 200 Did you have, we had to climb the rope in eighth grade. Yeah, a rope's different than a, pole, a slick pole. It's not hot yet. Okay. There ain't no way I could get up there. Alright, that's are steady. Look at this. <laughs> I'm just, that's fine, Robert. I'm just, you're fine. You don't have to. You put a rope up, I'll be in the top of that. <laughs> but I'm not climbing that. Why did they put pipe? I don't know. Probably because the rope's disintegrated and there's no way I can't get grip. It's like you put a olive oil on it. Yeah. No, this is a little higher. Oh, come on. <laughs> I saw you walk the rails on the train track. Here we go. Should I do a flip dismount? <laughs> flip dismount. Ooh, there we go. Yes, back flip at the end. 